All right, guys, so I'm gonna be putting on the rear lip and I'm um, just admiring the front lip right here, even though like it looks pretty bad um, as far as like the double sided tape, but I just can't believe how much of an improvement, you know, something so small can make, you know, it's kind of crazy. That looks pretty dang good. So I'm gonna put the rear lip on. Don't mind all the junk in the back. This looks like a total disaster, but this is all stuff that uh, you know I've been using and stuff. So I gotta take all this stuff out. But I'm gonna put uh, the rear, and I'm gonna clean the whole strip, like clean right here, so that strip of uh, double-sided tape could uh, you know adhere pretty good. So kind of dusty. I'm gonna clean it, and then I'm gonna uh, clean it with alcohol because I had actually uh, waxed this. But yeah, so. Let me do that quick and pop it on. Let's see how it looks like. All right, so got some uh, rubbing alcohol, microfiber. I gotta find the actual um, bracket, like little brackets that go right here, these little holes. And there's another one right there. So I gotta find those and um, comes with the nut and bolt. So it's, it kind of has like all the hardware. And then they go right here where the original mud flaps will go, like right there so we'll just see how this goes all right guys so it kind of sucks though because i found the bracket well the hardware and the three brackets but they're labeled one's a and the other one's uh this one's b but there's no actual instructions on how to do this and there's only two holes one hole here and one hole there and there's three brackets so what's that about? And there's also three uh, machine screws with actually with uh, locking, locking washers and yeah, so, and then uh, three nuts too. So I actually really don't even get this, but what I'm gonna end up doing is just mounting it on both sides and then putting some uh, double-sided tape and just figuring out these brackets on the bottom. We'll see how that goes. All right, guys, so that's basically how it goes. Just like that. Gap is a little bit wide right there, but I'll fix that up. But I'm actually kind of worried about this thing actually falling because the double-sided tape I have, I don't know if it's the greatest, but I'm also going to use those brackets, but if this thing comes loose, uh, that's basically the end of it. And it's going to be pretty embarrassing because the screws that are on each side where the mud flaps go, uh, it's going to hold it on, but it's just going to fall down like that. So basically what I'm going to do is uh, get some double-sided tape and um, put it up right here. All right, guys. So I got a little bit of it done right there. I have like a, the paint for like a guideline and it's looking pretty good. It's a little bit thick gap right here, but it's okay. It goes all the way across, and then I still haven't even attached this yet, so I gotta do this part next. But it's coming together though, slowly but surely. All right guys, so that's how it looks right there. It doesn't look too bad. So people across the street are playing uh, Spanish music, so don't mind that. But overall, it looks very, very good. Just got to take this off. Slowly, don't want to take off any paint or anything, any clear. So yeah, so. So far, so good. Now I just got to mount up those brackets somehow. All right, guys, so this is how the lip looks. Um, I honestly didn't really want to show too much more of the footage because uh yeah that was like kind of painful to watch because you can't really throw these lips on if you want them to look a little bit decent i mean you could definitely slap it on and it'll look pretty bad but i i did have to redo some parts where uh the glue of the double-sided tape well like i had put it on and then the freaking the lip it just wanted to like go down on its own 
and then it left like all this glue residue but you could definitely see the tape right there and there's like another strip right here and yeah so and then it's actually lower than where I want it there's like it should be I want it to be up here because that's what you know like the uh, the genuine type R lip looks like but it's okay and then another thing with this lip is that it kind of goes like this but it curves like this curve is not really um, genuine like the actual type R lip it looks like it just goes out and there's just a hard edge and then it just drops off but this one actually has a curve at the bottom which is like I mean I'm not gonna lie it matches the car so can't really complain that much and in the light that you see you see it more silver but in person from you know a few feet away it definitely looks nice but yeah so you can see more of the tape right here but from back here you can't really see anything so yeah so and then this side it started coming loose right there and then um i just gotta make sure it's applied and everything and this tape is like brutal like the one that i'm using i'll probably uh well i gotta check out what it exactly it is but it's actually meant for hanging up mirrors and stuff like that and yeah it's like some pretty good stuff but i didn't really stick this down because i was kind of in a hurry but right here is very very dull so i gotta maybe wet sand this a little bit polish it out but i'm not even worried about it but yeah so that's how it looks it doesn't look too bad i'm pretty impressed with how low cost these things are and what you get i mean would genuine look better hell yeah you know but it's all good all right guys so let's uh do a little 360 around that's with the rear lip on and the front lip right there right here oh yeah so that doesn't look bad at all right there Then I'll show you how I actually mounted it. It came with all the hardware and everything, so it came with a nuts bolt. Oh, shit, I'm missing a screw right here. But yeah, so it should be two screws. One screw here, and I got that screw in right there. And then let me try and get down, and yeah, hold on. All right, so this is how it looks. Right there, so basically there was a nut bolt and a lock washer with the screw in the little bracket there's that one and right there so yeah so that's basically how it is and that thing is super 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 sturdy at first I was kind of worried about it you know uh, you know falling off or whatever but no this is like pretty legit like what they offer all right so it's kind of noisy across the street some guy in a bullhorn or something all right guys so that's gonna be the end for this little video if you want to see more updates please like subscribe and comment let me know what you think and yeah so so i'll probably just do like a little um cinematic and let's see how it looks all right guys take care